Now let's delete a book. For deleting a book, we just need its ID and we don't need body. So let's implement it. We need a new route for deleting a book. For method, we use app.delete. Delete method is the standard HTTP method to delete a resource. For route, we use a slash books a slash colon ID. Again, we have an async callback function and then try catch blocks. In catch, we receive the error. First, I log it to the server console, then I return a response with a status of 500 and error message. Now, let's go to the try block. I destructure the ID from request.params, then I use book.findById and delete and pass book ID to it. And I save the result in a variable name, result. Then I check the result. If the result is false, I return a status of 404 with an error message. Else, I return a status of 200 with a success message. You can use any message as you wish. Now, let's go to the postman and test our new HTTP route. I must create a new request. The request method is delete. The URL is again like the update, so let's copy one book ID and use it here. And I don't need body, so I simply click send to see the result. And if we see our success message, it means that everything works fine and our book deleted successfully. 